been almost a month since Chip Weird of St. Louis was hit by a truck near Hannibal. His wife still struggles with the fact that whoever killed her husband is still out there. In a WGM exclusive, our Katie Wall sat down with Rebecca Weird to learn more about what happened that night and how you can help find the person responsible for her husband's death. I thought I was going to have him forever. I thought we were going to grow old together. <laughs> I'm still just, I, I can't believe he's gone. What started as a normal fall weekend ended in tragedy. <laughs> Rebecca and Chip Weird were active members of the group SCA, an educational group that reenacts middle-aged times. On the way home from an SCA event in Hannibal, they pulled over with car trouble here by the U.S. 24 exit ramp. Chip then walked to the nearest exit sign so they could call for help. This truck comes flying down up the exit ramp and we hear this loud bang. It sounded more like a something falling off the truck. But that noise was Chip. He was hit by what authorities think was a truck or SUV. It was his wife who called 911, and Chip was later pronounced dead on the scene. And when I touched him, it's like his body was already noticeably cool. So I already knew. Missouri State Highway Patrol officials haven't found the driver who killed Rebecca's husband and fled the scene. They've had leads, but nothing has turned up. I, I really hope they find who did this. Because I'd really like to kind of make some sense out of what the, what happened. It's been about two and a half weeks since Rebecca's husband of nearly a decade was killed on that Saturday night. Rebecca says she's still in shock. The support of her family and friends is helping her get through it. Such an outpouring of, we want to take care of you. And Rebecca wants Chip to be remembered as the gentleman he was. He was a good, kind man. They just... Don't make enough like him. Katie Walls, WGEM News. The Missouri State Highway Patrol wants your help to find the driver. They're looking for a late 1980s or early 1990s GMC or Chevy pickup truck or SUV, possibly still with damage to the front end. The hit and run happened Saturday, September 29th, around 8.30 p.m. If you have any information, call the Highway Patrol at 660-385-2132.